Fend One onboard technology rear linkage. Open the menu wire launch pad. Actually, the rear linkage is locked. You can unlock it here or direct here on the armrest. Now you can connect your implement with this switch here, centimeter up or centimeter down with your linkage. When the implement is connected, then you have to choose the float mode or the regulating mode here. Actually, we are starting with the float mode, for example, the mulcher. Yeah. Here in the terminal you see the maximum height, the current height, the speed up and the speed down for your linkage. Yeah. When you start working completely up the implement or completely down the implement in the float position. When you change you implement for example to a plow then you have to switch on this control mode for the rear linkage then it's possible to set here a value for the control of your rear linkage we see we have here a drop the drop is for the working position yeah you set it for example to number six here okay the lift up the rear linkage and when you lowering down to working position then you see it stops by around about 40 percent when you open our settings in the settings it's possible to activate the double acting rear linkage here we have the possibility to make some settings for our draft control here we have our active dampening which we can activate and set a speed here we set the percentage when our rear PTO starts and stops when we are using the automatic function rear linkage and PTO together and in the last we have here the possibility to choose between one and two working positions now we have here two drops that means we have the possibility to set two working positions how to use it lift up your implement lowering down your implement it goes to working position deep go to working position up double click double click is necessary because you push down the button and the implement goes up go to the lower position a single click is enough with this automatic button it's possible to use your linkage here on the go and end button you see it becomes blue go means front linkage goes in the working position and means the rear linkage goes up to the headland position